All right, hello everybody. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Scarlet. Wrong button. Without further ado, let's continue with this storyline. The Zero Gate. Oh my gosh. Nope, pressing wrong buttons everywhere. Nope, stop it. Pressing... It's been a while since I've played. Stop it! Oh my gosh. Okay, fine, let's save. <coughs> Apologies, I'm a little sick, ladies and gentlemen. We're recovering, recovering well. We want to fly here. Now, I know this part is pretty long, so we're going to have to break it up into smaller parts. Or do some major editing. But we've captured, last episodes we captured the artifacts of ruin uh, nope the last episode we were we captured whoops the ruin Pokemon Wo Qian Qi Yu Qian Pao and Ting Lu now we're going to area zero where I heard there's some strong Pokemon so we're gonna go with our A team gonna go to that gate over there I'll try not to get distracted oh my gosh how do I okay it's been a while since I've played to you guys it seems like I've I've been playing non-stop week after week uh, but in actuality, there a lot of my videos are pre-recorded. They're on a schedule. And because they're on a schedule, I plan them way ahead in advance. Um, it's been maybe three months since I've played Pokemon, believe it or not. <laughs> it was made so researchers could try to observe the inside of the great crater of Paldea, what folks call Area Zero. It's our ticket down into the crater. Oh, and speaking of the crater, you know that Pokemon of yours, the one I gave you? Area Zero is apparently where Coridon was born, or something like that. Maybe it'll be happy that it can finally come back home. Not that I really care or anything. Anyway, our two new teammates should be waiting for us inside the Zero Gate. The Way Home. So yeah, it's been about three months since I played Pokemon. Uh, all these videos I recorded was before the birth of my baby boy. He is now healthy, doing some checkups, getting some shots. So thank you everyone for your support and your patience there. We're gonna keep, keep on, keep on here. We have not yet seen the title screen to Pokemon Scarlet, so that's what we're aiming for. Kinda of dark in here. Hey, hola Kaleo. Arvin said there'd be tons of strong Pokemon, so here I am. When she heard she got to battle awesome Pokemon, she was here in a second. <laughs> You're an annoying little pest at the Academy, but I guess you could come in handy for this. Spoken like a guy who wants to get beaten in a battle. But more importantly, why is it so dark and where's the awesome Pokemon? Yeah, it is weird that the lights are off. The last time I was here, the electricity was up and running. Well, now the lights are on. But why? I I turned them on. Penny! Seems like they were on a power saving mode. I hacked into the system controls and overrode the settings. Oh, it's you, that kid with the fluffy Eevee bag. I want it. And I want my hair color that, like that. Um, I guess my name is Penny. Hey, well hey, we never got to actually talk. I'm Nimona, I'm in class 1A. You must be some kid of tech wits. Did you like Pokemon battling too? 
Eric, you talk like you weigh too much. The director introduced us. When you need someone good with tech, she's a no-brainer. Anyway, Penny here has also agreed to second. Agreed in a, also agreed in a second when she heard it was to help Kaleo. I'm not really the adventuring type, but I owe you, and I pay my debts. She's surprisingly old-fashioned like that. And of course, everyone knows me, Arvin. My love, is, my loves include my mabostiff and cooking and biometric identifications in progress. Hello, I've been expecting you. And it seems you have gathered a group of formidable allies as well. Sorry, who are you? That's my mom. Probably. <laughs> what? That's Professor Sada? Nemona, student ID number 805C001. And Penny, student ID 803B121. I thank you for coming. Oh, of course, Professor. Oh my gosh, it's such an honor to meet you in person. I mean, maybe not in person, exactly. Arvin, did you uh, tell your mom about us? When would I have done that? To begin with, I'd like to ask you all to make your way down into the great crater of Baldea. You can reach the lower chamber using the elevator you can see to your right. Uh, mom? Please proceed below. Ooh. Just ignored her. Are they not on good terms? Must not be. <coughs> Excuse me, folks. If I hear uh, some bustling and then some mute, it's because I'm going on mute to cough. Oh, God. <laughs> Identification in progress. Identities confirmed. Access granted to the lower level. Oh, it opened for us automatically. Not quite. Looks like to me someone's controlling this thing remotely. Once you step through, you will be above Area Zero. You have brought Koridon with you. Have you brought Koridon with you? I thank you for bringing it with you on your many adventures. If you utilize Koridon's gliding capabilities, you should be able to descend into the depths to reach Area Zero. Uh-oh. What? Isn't there like an elevator or something? And wait, did you say Koridon can fly? When you reach the bottom, I will get in touch once again. I hope your trip is unevent- what, unevent? Un- I, I can't wait to see what Pokemon live down there in Area Zero. Let's go! That girl, she is like- Incapable of fear or what? <laughs> I guess we better go too. No one's commented on my hat. I changed outfits. It's springtime. No one commented on my hat. Somebody say something about my hat. I have low self esteem. Okay, here we go. Hi -yo. I sneak up on you. <laughs> Ready for the worst? Oh my gosh. Not, not if you say it like that. Good. That's all we needed to hear. Get out that Pokemon of yours and we'll be off. Ooh, cutscene. Agia. Oh, he's scared. What's the matter with it? Hmm. Scared of heights. That's what I'd say. Well, no wonder. But no need to be scared if we go together. How does this logic work? How does that logic work? Is there room for me? You guys are leaving without me? It's my Pokemon. Oh. Oh god. This is not safe. Why are why are we Oh 
This is not safe at all. Now I'm back here again. I think I might have died once or twice there. What's wrong? It's okay, bud. Yes. Went back in his Pokeball. He chose to go back in his ball. It's probably just hungry or something. Wait a second, where's the student council girl? Ah, Nimona. Where'd you go? You don't think she... Everyone, you got to see this. Area Zero's amazing, girl. What did you run off to? Come on already. I guess your ability would be own tempo, huh? Ha. Biometric identification in progress. Four humans identified. Condition satisfactory. Vital signs all within normal range. It appears you were able to make the descent without being harmed. Why does this person sound robotic and then normal? <coughs> <coughs> so sorry. So sorry, people. Thank you. Ha, ah, yeah, sure. Smooth sailing. Who could have possibly complained about a landing like that? That is good. Wow, did you just... I had concerns you might fail, given the crudeness of your only available access method. I think your mom's sarcasm detector needs fixing. Ah, <laughs> uh, you, you are worried about us. That's so sweet. You should now make your way to me, to me at the Zero Lab in the deepest part of Area Zero. However, the entrance of the lab is barred by four locks installed on the exterior, which I cannot unlock four locks. On your way to me, you must visit four research stations that were constructed inside the crater. They look like that. They got lines. At each station, you will be able to disable one of the locks. Do so as you make your way down. I hope you succeed. Yes, let's disable the four locks and get into the lab. Sounds kind of video gamey when you say it out loud, huh? <gasps> How meta. Come on, time to find your way to the deepest part of Area Zero. This girl's too hyper. <laughs> My introvertness cannot handle it. Whoa. Oh, wow. We're just all hanging out here. Can I talk to you? No, I can't talk to you. Hey, who else can spin? Watch me spin. Nimona! Nimona! Okay, she's just not impressed. Alright, fine. Ooh, the song kicked in. That's scary. What's flying above me? <gasps> Braviary. I don't have you. Oh yeah, I'm trying not to get distracted here. I'm already failing. Uh, hang on a second. It's been a while. Please don't tell me I didn't come down here without any quick balls. Okay. Ha! Joke's on you, I'm fighting type. Oh god, my defense well. Uh, let's see. Okay, too strong. And now stronger. We've caught Giraffarig before. We've caught a Raichu before. Okay, we have to go down. How far are these researcher research stations? Because... Oh my gosh. Is that one of them? That looks like one of them. 
I have to reach all the way down there. There's a rainbow. I have to reach all the way down there. Have I caught you before, Corbin? I guess. So this is inside the Great Crater. It feels different from just seeing it in our textbooks. Normally we'd be able to get in here, huh? Where did Goraidon go? Seems it's being spooked or something, but... Insidious, that's not good. Can we even get to... Ah! <laughs> what you're offering? Get out of my personal space. I wasn't even paying you attention. Ah, <laughs> I caught a flying taxi out here, out of the crater. Why didn't you just call the professor if she'd be down here? None of your business, Pipsqueak. Jeez, no need to bite my head off. Okay, come, you two. This is an adventure. Let's just have it. You guys talk so fast. Ganmon Berry. Gosh, Venomots everywhere. Ah, water, slowing me down. How are you running so fast? Oh. My gosh, it's been such a long time since I played Pokemon. I forgot my controls. Is this running or can I run faster? That's crouching. That's my map. Okay, hang on, back up. That's the menu, right? Ah, oh, get away from me! <laughs> Why are the giraffes chasing me? My gosh, there's so much to explore. I'm going to have to cut some of this out. If... These things are going to be far, far apart from each other, aren't they? Oh my gosh. So Penny, how'd you wind up friends with the... Well, well I guess he really came through. You guys talk so fast. It was a big help getting to the sorted out. Guess oh wow, so Jim, that's awesome. What about you then, Mona? I are clear on Knippers are home, plus I said should come to champion. He said, sure, champion, but wait, that's wild. Hold it right there, you two. You think you've got cool friendship origin stories? They're nothing compared to me and him. Our friendship is on another level. Nobody asked you, stop trying to flex on us. Guess we're all the buds with Okay. Okay, so pretty much they were competing as to who who was my most best friend, Salak Fairy. There's a bunch of new items here, and I have to explore, but my OCD wants to get in the way so bad. I mean, my ADD. Chansey. Somebody sleeping. Pichu fur. Did I go that way? No, I think that way. I do have jump plus, yeah? No, I don't. I've never seen a jump plus. I want that one in the middle. Now get away! Quick ball! Yay! Travels and seasonal winds. Once its cotton spores run out, its journey its journeys its journey ends. As does oh my gosh. It what a dark turn. I love jump bluff. So if the cotton runs out, it Oh my gosh, did I did I take a wrong turn somewhere? Did I cross that bridge? Is there a way to get over there? Why can't we just fly down there with Koridon? Oh my gosh. Wait, there's a building over there. I totally missed that. Oh, I went came down this way. Oh, okay. Citrus berries. I bet that's what we're looking for. That 
must be one of the buildings the professor was talking about. Oh yeah, what are they called? Radish stations? <laughs> Research stations. <laughs> Radish. Uh, honey, I'll be back. I gotta go to the radish station. Okay. Don't get it confused with beet juice. Wow, you have such great memory, Penny. What's great is my common sense compared to you lot, apparently. <laughs> Shreen. Uh-oh. Oh. That's the Pokemon La Primera uses. I didn't know that species could be found in a great crater. Come on, let's take it on together. Why am I so little? Short Kings! It's a rock poison. Toxic Debris. I, when I first saw that word, I thought it was Debris, but then the teacher said it's debris. And I'm like, what about the S? She's like, it's silent. I'm like, what? Are there going to be a lot more of these rare Pokemon down here, you think? You think that's, that was something? Please, you've got no idea how terrifying Area Zero really is. Wow, patronizing much? Easy, you two. Let's just head inside the research station. Okay, but I saw an item and I want to get it first. And I move now. I will go inside, but I saw an item back here. Oh my gosh! What are you doing out here, Brave Yuri? Ah, ah, ah. It's chasing after me on its little, and its little, and its, and its. Oh god, I'm stuck. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, I'm trapped. Ah, ah. <laughs> A big old bird chasing after you is terrifying. Something's growing on these trees. It looked like crystals. Oh, Nimona, is this your Pokemon? Excuse me. Oh. Are these ancient ruins? <laughs> they look far too recent for that. It appears you have reached your first research station without incident. The facility was constructed 87 years ago as a way station for those serving Area Zero. So that's why there's a bed? <laughs> Looks like we can use this place to rest up if we need to. If you would be so kind to disable the first lock on the lab using that central panel. What if I don't want to? Does this spell out zero in Pokemon language? Z E R O. Interesting. Thanks to my prototype Terra Orb, I secured corporate funding for my research and made a laboratory in the lighthouse near Cabo Poco. Someday, though, I'll return to the crater and re resume my study of these crystals. Oh. We've determined that this energy crystallization is linked to the beam we call. The interlocking hexagonal plates that compromise, that comprise Blanks's shell must somehow cause this phenomenon, which I've dubbed terastalizing. Some lore. Do you want to press the button to disable one of the locks in Zero Lab? Sure. Well done. Please continue your efforts at the remaining research stations. Oh boy. <laughs> Excuse me while I drink some water, folks. Okay. Can I talk to you? Can I talk to you guys? No? Nobody wants to talk to me? Oh. 
I want to check out the other rooms, but the doors are busted, so yeah, this is going great. <laughs> Looks like you get a decent rest in the bed over there. No, 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 no. Yep, yep. Oh my gosh, I slipped. I wonder if my mom ever worked here. This looks interesting. No other items here. Oh. Is that to go back? Where would you like to go? Uh huh. It's like fast travel. Maybe between stations and back to the top, top. I'm gonna cough when I mute myself. <coughs> <coughs> Almost never saw my mom. Oh, is it time for Penny Shush? She was always busy with work, hardly ever came home. But I cooked for myself, cleaned for myself. So yeah, I don't really know her at all. I try not to think of it too much. But this truth is I wouldn't rather I haven't seen her for ages now, unless you count seeing her I used to at least get emails sometimes. And she appears out of the blue. Some family, right? But were you not? We're not here to judge anything. I'm sorry about earlier. Shouldn't have snapped like that. Nah, I was also giving you a hard time. Penny, my name's Penny. You know you're actually pretty nice for a little pipsqueak. Don't call me a pipsqueak, you big lunk. That's the spirit, you two. <laughs> Last time I came to the Great Crater, I was trying to go see my mom. I got this about this far, then I got attacked. What kind of Pokemon was it? It wasn't evil like a Pokemon, more like a crazy violent rampaging. Sure, it was just a Pokemon that's a little more, I don't know, rampaging? Yeah, I'm sure it was completely different from altogether. It hurt my boss stiff. Awful thing. Oh, I can't get, I can't engage. Ah! Oh my gosh, okay, I don't have a time thing. counts as a cave, does it? Yeah! Alright! Scorching Pokemon. It has top-notch flying capabilities. It flies around easily, even while carrying prey that weighs more than 220 pounds. Whoa. Okay. I see another research station. Whoa! Our luchas are down here. Wait, I don't have... Hey, you're fast, Garnacle. I do not have a Garnacle. I evolved one of them. Whoa. How Lucha just glided over. Rock Salt Garnacle will rub its fingertips together and sprinkle injured Pokemon with salt. Even severe wounds will promptly heal afterward. It'll hurt though. Might want to mention that it will hurt you. Someone's behind me. <gasps> All these sparkly things in the distance make me think there's items there, but there isn't. It's gonna trigger another cutscene, is it? <coughs> Excuse me. Second research station, about time, too.
P, let's head in and take a breather. I thought you'd have a bit more stamina, student council girl. <laughs> oh, I'm just full of surprises. That wasn't a compliment, you know? Oh, <laughs> <gasps> it's the Scream Tail! Hey, look at Jigglypuff. It's good to see some nice, familiar Pokemon down here, too. Wow, so cool looking. Look at that pompadour. Oh my gosh, so cute. Pura. Cleo, it's battle time. Let's go, Penny. It's got Jigglypuff cries with that modified. Uh. Wait, so what is it now? It's not normal fairy. I like how the... The Scarlet Pokemon have their normal battle cries modified with that little... Like, old... That sound to clarify that it's... From the past. The Violet Pokemon have their normal cries with that modified sound that sounds like clicking mechanical seriously what was that darn thing scared me half to death it was definitely kind of ferocious for a jigglypuff wasn't it <laughs> no kidding come on let's get inside already one more jump scare like that and I'm done for you're telling me Alright, as much as I want to explore and probably get all the items I missed, we're going to have to like break this up into a couple of videos. This is already 30 minutes long and I don't want to make it longer. You guys are giving me good feedback and I'm listening. Seems like while Pokemon don't come here, we should be safe to catch our breath. Hey, seriously, what's with this place? That Pokemon? I've been wondering about that myself. I think maybe that Pokemon was one of these. What's that book? We've already read that. We've already read that. Monsters of Area Zero. So they aren't actually Pokemon? I don't really know. What do you think, Kaleo? I don't think they're regular Pokemon. I think they really are just Pokemon. Yeah, same. I mean, they look different, sure, but they use moves in battle just like the Pokemon we know. I suppose the time has come for an explanation. <clears throat> Professor, some of the life forms that you see residing now within Area Zero are ancient Pokemon that lived in a distant past long lost to us. Ancient Pokemon? What? That's awesome. Oh, come on. There's no way that's possible. The Zero Lab where I am located contains a time machine. It summons the ancient Pokemon to this place. So the thing my mom spent forever researching down here, she actually got it working? Indeed, though the cost was catastrophic. The cost? But a time machine? You mean you can actually travel to and from the past? It is theoretically possible to travel to the past. However, for a being such as a human, it would not be possible to return to the present. Well, that's horrifying. Mom, you... Why did you call us here to Area Zero? Arvin, I... If possible, I would like us to speak when we can meet face to face. It will be easier for you to understand once you can see the situation for yourself. Now then, please use the central panel here and disable another lock on my lab. Read some lore! The crystal's power it's the crystal's power is tremendous. Their unstable output made our corporate backers fret. But if we can harness this energy, it'll open up research possibilities we'd only dream of. That last paradise will be ours to create. At last I can resume work on the Terra project. 
I'll move my research to the Zero Lab this month. The team will be smaller, but no matter. The strong influence of the crystals make our experiments much more... Well done. Please continue your efforts at the remaining research stations. I know that book she told me to bring. I think it's got something to do with this place. One more or more like everything to do with this place. But I'm not the one she expects to fix whatever all this is. You are. I think you should be the one to carry it. Scarlet book. Are these available now? I, I need to check on Amazon. I want these books. I used to collect all the guides to every Pokemon. I didn't realize that later on they'd be worth like a lot of money. I do have some that are kind of in okay condition, but I remember this one kid from high school who was really serious about them. A record of the expedition that the author Heath when went on with went on within the Greek record of the other book has the name Sada written on it, clumsily handwriting. Take care of it for me. Okay, let's rest up here. And these are gonna take long. I don't wanna. I've been listening to you guys' feedback, and I appreciate it. Uh, special shout out to Shadow uh, for all the constant support and uh, feedback, and all the good stuff you've been giving me. I really appreciate it. So we're gonna break it up here. We're gonna end the the gameplay and we'll pick up the next chapter where we the next chapter the next one the next episode because these look really long it looks really long all right so i'll see you guys let's save it downloadable content right there in the corner we're gonna get that when it comes out oops Alright, so as always, we spin, 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 spin. See you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye. Like and subscribe. I gotta, I gotta say that on every episode, because YouTube's crazy. Like and subscribe. Now, bye-bye.